Installing our flex shaft joystick handles is really very easy. The first thing is to identify the correct size of the stem on the joystick controller itself. So just remove the existing knob. You'll see that there are really just two diameters of stem that you're going to find on the market. Uh, 3 sixteenths in diameter and quarter inch. And so we have both models available in all of the different shapes of handle. The 3 sixteenths and the quarter inch. So selecting the right handle, the next thing you do is to clean off the metal stem. I typically do that with a little bit of denatured alcohol, but any solvent will work. Get it nice and clean, and then press the flex shaft on all the way. You can rotate it a little bit to make sure that all of the air comes out. And you want to let that rest for about an hour uh, before you put it into use. That allows all of the air to evacuate from inside of the polyurethane flex shaft. And after about an hour, it's going to be really quite secure. I've got a couple handles here which I installed earlier. And you can see that it's really quite strong, given a little bit of time for the polyurethane to shrink back down to a tight fit on the stem. But there are occasions when you need something even more secure than that. And there's a simple solution for that. And all you need is a little bit of hairspray and a rag. So taking the joystick box, Take the rag or a piece of cloth just to protect the rest of the box. Spray a little bit of hairspray on the metal stem and then do the installation as before. The hairspray actually makes it very easy to get the stem into place because it acts to make it kind of a, a little bit slippery. Let that rest for about an hour. I've got another handle here which I installed about an hour ago with the hairspray, and once the hairspray is on, it's virtually impossible to get the joystick handle to twist or pull off the stem. So that's a very permanent installation.